Welcome, everybody. We are here with another Metal Monday. How you doing, Brett? I'm good, Nick. How you doing, man? I'm good, man. I had a great weekend. Ready to attack this week, and we're into a new month, man. Do you have any any Ferris details yet? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's trending positive. Um, I'm thinking that the market should move up. Um, the export market has been going well. well. Hopefully, that's enough to keep the domestic guys on their toes a little bit. So I'm thinking that we're going to see up money across the board, but I don't know. I guess time will tell. I haven't got any strong um, indications, pricing, whatever yet, but I, I'm I'm anticipating a better a better a better August pricing than July. I read. Um, I just scanned the AMM this morning and I saw a mill reopened. Yeah. You know, so and they're bumping the price on some news still. Yeah. So I mean, I, that's always a good sign. I would, you know, I would hope at least it would kind of trickle. I think it's trends in the right direction. I think that's all we can ask for. Is, I mean, in the commodities business, it feels like you get these blips, and sometimes you know. But if you just, sometimes the trend is your friend. I guess is what they say. So you kind of ride the trend a little bit. If it feels like there's some momentum and things are kind of moving, then yeah, that's definitely the, that's definitely the goal. So. I mean, non-ferrous markets, you know, they kind of took a hit a little bit last week, at least on the copper side. But yeah, a little correction. They bounced back this morning. Mm-hmm. That's looking good. Nickel's looking good. Aluminum just seems like it's steadily gaining more strength, you know. Um, auto sales were good. Yeah. I mean, July auto sales were, you know, moved at a quicker pace than I think people anticipated. So that's going to help push that aluminum market um, for sure. So, I don't know, it feels like, you know, we're at – we're in a positive, you know, environment for pricing for commodities. Yeah, I feel that way. You know, obviously, I hope that it keeps trending upward. And we did have that correction last week, which is to be expected. I mean, copper ran so hard, so fast. Like, it typically, you'll see a small correction in there. Yeah. Um, you know, and your platinum, palladium, rhodium, that all kind of had a little correction, too. Yep, last but today, week. Today, it's up 10 bucks or so. Yeah, today. it's kind of bounced up a little bit. Yeah. So, but you need some corrections every once in a while. I think that's a healthy, it's a healthy move. You know, silver came back off a little bit. You yeah. Know, some of those are your, you know, your more industrial metals. You know, they're they kind of came back off, and I I don't know. I th- I think they're going to trend. It looks like in the right direction, which is a big, which is a big deal. Um. So I, it's looking August so far is looking decent. Um. I'm not complaining anytime it's sideways to up. It feels mm-hmm. like it's a guy stands a chance. So. We'll uh, just keep keep on grinding. And last week, uh, you announced we we're doing some t shirts for charity. Correct. We've done, it's been about a week. We've done like 35 or 40 shirts right now. Nice. Which is awesome. So thank you, yeah. everybody that did that. We appreciate, we appreciate it. And the charity appreciates it. And I think it's just a good, it's a good thing to keep, yeah. keep momentum in our industry. And we sh- we shipped them all, all the ones that came in before Friday, we shipped them on Friday. So those should be out to everybody here this week. Nice. Okay. All right. All right, man. Appreciate it. And uh, you guys all have a great week. Thanks, everybody.